Hustle. Back again. Yes. Hopefully you like Godzilla episode. Hopefully he liked the movie. I've only seen Godzilla Rays again once, so this only be my second time watching it. So But then there's a lot of Godzilla movies I've only seen once, but there's a lot of them I've seen a bunch of times. Like fucking Invasion Astro Monster is my favorite. Okay. Or Godzilla vs. Monster Zero if you like me and had the videotape back in the day. Ooh. I used to change the fucking times all the time. So PJ. Yeah. Cards. Yes. <laughs> As usual, I'm just gonna flat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lay him on the table until okay. he see, feels the energy from one that he likes. Yes. So here we go. I think that was last one. I felt good energy. I hope so. Yeah, another one was bag, so it would have been whatever. So. Yeah. It makes life easier. I didn't have to put that in the bag. So here we go. Okay. Card one. Yes or no? Nah. Two. Nah. Three. Nah. Four. Nah. Five. Yes. Five. Okay. You want that? Five card. is my number for some reason. I need All you to right. get through some. Okay. All right. Okay. Six. No. Seven. No. Eight. No. Nine. No. Ten. No. Eleven. 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 <sighs> All right. Two cards right there. Which one you feeling, PJ? They're on the table. This says. Pour a drink. This says. I'm getting the pen ready to see what I got to write down in my calendar right here. Got you want the left one. What's on that card, PJ? Okay. Oh, a vinegar syndrome. Oh. Okay. Who who did we do that with syndrome? With vinegar syndrome movies, we've done all the Dolomite movies. Oh. Um. Let's go. Okay. Fuck. I can't do any more. I mean, I know for sure those are vinegar syndrome movies. We did. Oh, okay. Sweet Sweet Back was vinegar syndrome release. Oh. Oh, I'm ready then. Okay. They do other shit though. They got like horror shit. Like I got a big box of this shit down there too. Okay. But I guess I'm actually have to go upstairs for this one because all my vinegar syndrome movies are upstairs. Okay. So I will try to not wake the spirit up. But you guys watch this. Just wait. I'll, I'll, I might have to edit this out. Yes. What didn't he pick though? He had a PJ pick. Of course. He didn't pick his own of face. Of course. God damn. So let me go. Oh, you want to do it now? Yeah. I was just going to tell him to come back and y'all. But. Nah, because that, that means Brick got to do more. You know, I, I see. So, nah, well, in the meantime, nah, in between time, where come. Are, where are the bag going? Uh-oh. Brent gotta find bags first. Scusi. Yes. I don't know. I'm what is it? Magnifico? Si Magnifico. Si Magnifico. Ha <laughs> ha. Hmm. That's Italiano? Hmm. Mambo Italiano. Sorry. He's trying to find shit. I'm distracted. I am. I, I, no, it's fine. Just, just keep him keep entertained, PJ. Ah. Were y'all entertained Where the right fuck there? Where did I put that bag at? Yeah, I'm about to leave it. It's not on the black and white? It's my life. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. I think it is. You said it is, therefore it is. Uh, they say, come on, get this shit done nice. right now. Oh. It is nice. Boo. Is this even in a shot? No, fuck, I ain't throwing back on that. Oh, there it is. Gotcha. Wow. Gotcha. Okay. Is there a vinegar syndrome in here? I okay. know there's a shout factor in this. If there is, let's do that one. Nope. Ah. So, what's down here? Is What's down here anything? Nah, I don't want to do nothing. So, yeah, I'll be back. Oh. Oh, I need my phone. So Just right. kidding. Um. Ha. They don't know something. I didn't think this through. They don't know. Hold on. Watch this. Watch this. Go, go. 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 Watch this. Y'all, y'all, y'all with me, right? Y'all with me. What he doesn't know. Watch this. This is for him. Who wanna take his cup? Who wanna take this? Who wanna place it ever so gently on his side? Shot. You won't even notice it's in front of him. We're just going to see that bow right there. Okay. Okay. That is. Okay. P.S. You don't want a friend like me. I will get you drunk. Cause I am an alcoholic. Just so you know. But not really. But here you go. Ready? Are you ready for this? She has left. Okay. You won't know that it's on. Just... Nothing ever happened. It's between me and you. Sorry, I've been looking at this, but it said that he's back. All right, let's go. Ah.
You back. Fuck. We had a one on one. Oh, did you? Yes. A TV show? Huh? Ah. <laughs> damn it, Kyla. Oh, that was another one for you? Yes. Oh, really? I didn't yeah. know about that one. I'll take the slip cover off this one. You didn't know about Kyla? I knew about her. I didn't know Me that. Me and was Kyla one Pratt? Your, I didn't know that was one of yours. Was yeah. One of your crushes. I thought that was. Oh. I didn't know. She's up there. So she you was, was, my... was fucking with Doctor Doolittle too, hey? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. She was. She's around our age, right? Yeah. Yeah. All I'm saying, Kyla, she's with a white girl, white guy, right? I don't know. Doesn't matter. Just kidding. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. All right, Vinegar Syndrome. Yeah, I threw a couple movies in there. Not a lot of them though. Mm-hmm. But I was just saying, fuck it. Too black, too white. There you go. <laughs> too black, too white. I didn't throw a line in. I ain't gonna be able to do too long making noise. Like, yeah. All right. All right. I don't know about that reaction right there. Uh, that was the first one I've touched. Mm. Mm. Okay. One of these actually has two movies on it, so I guess you would just pick which one you want to watch. Um, I don't want to say that because that's going to give it away. Uh, right. Let's do that. I'll, I'll just pick one. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yeah, you just do you. Uh, I like the way this case feels. It feels. Yeah. Which one? This one. Uh-oh. Yeah, Uh-oh. it's got two movies on it. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> they they saw probably what I just did. Okay. Um, <coughs> oh, okay. Fuck. They're, they're both directed by Jamal Fanaka. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. Um, Jamal. Okay, I'm gonna just read the description for both. You tell me which one you want to watch. Okay. In his debut, in his second. In his debut. That's it. Second. That's really? One. Yep. Oh. Intuition. Okay, well, all right. Well, I guess play the trailer. Play the trailer. And oh my God, I'm sorry to hear PJ's oh. comments on this movie. Okay, okay. Honey, this is the surprise I wrote you about. So girl, this is Emma May, your first cousin. She's gonna live with us now. Yeah, I sure got some pretty cousins. I'm so glad they days to pick me out all my sisters and brothers to come live with y'all. When the sun came up each morning. each other up in the streets. Then when we try to do something the way they say it's supposed to be done, they mess with us and try to shut us down. There'll come a time in your life when you're going to have to make a decision. If people don't understand. feature movie MMA MMA here's the description okay. in his second feature MMA it tells the story of a naive young woman who moves from the deep south to Watts initially finding herself at odds with her surroundings Emma eventually gains acceptance from a local drug addict and dealer but when he's arrested in jail she plans a daring bank robbery to bail him out mm. featuring a cast of mostly non-professionals and shot entirely on location in Watts mm. this uniquely subversive action film is an insider's view of black working class LA neighborhood Mm. This was actually, it was released through Xenon as a 
uh, fuck, what was it called? Is it like Black Sisters Revenge or some shit like that? I think it had a different title. Okay. So. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then I'll just watch. I'll tell Something you, like you can watch that. The other movie you didn't pick was called Welcome Home, Brother Charles, which I'm pretty sure was retitled by Xenon, also as Soul Vengeance. Okay. In his debut feature, Welcome Home, Brother Charles, a young black man is sent to prison after being brutalized by a corrupt racist cop. Oh. Upon release, he takes daily revenge against the cops, lawyers, and thugs who got him busted using a most unusual weapon. I'm not even going to spoil what that is. Okay. As much of a parody of exploitation films as it is a proud piece of genre cinema, Brother Charles combines horror and black exploitation tropes with stirring social context or subtext resulting in a driving movie unlike any other. Ah. Watch it another day. You okay. didn't pick a movie called The Fear. The Fear. That's just that's the time. That's the cover. Oh. Yeah. Oh. It's um basically I watched this. I left a quick review for it a while back. Okay. It was uh there's a this is like a guy is training to be like a psychiatrist and he has a bunch of people come up to his cabin and there's like a big wooden doll or wood like a life size like wooden thing and it comes to life. And ah. yeah, that's what happened. Uh, yeah. Like CGI comes no, to no, life. No, it's or? actually it's it's actually makeup, real person, but it looks actually looks like wood. Uh, it's crazy. It was good ass makeup. Uh, mm-hmm. So yeah, I, I gave it this props. It looked good. Okay. But we are going to watch MMA. Okay. I'm pretty sure it was actually. I'm pretty sure the other title was like. Let me look up the other title. Okay. So, it's not. Just wait a minute. It's something Sisters Revenge. I don't think it was Black Sisters Revenge. It was something though. Uh, Give me you a like second. Take a shot. Uh, fuck it. I mean, one second. Let me watch that movie. Man. Of course. <laughs> uh, MMA. Yes, MMA. We've been here. Yeah. Oh, I see the score. I guess I don't have people for it. I'm curious if that'll be the same or not. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, okay. But it was Black Sisters Revenge. I had it right on tripping. Yeah. That was the title when they got re-released by Xenon. They, they like changing titles for some reason. Okay. From... They did they get paid like, off for the title change, or they just... I don't know. It's kind of like when we did a Quiet Storm and it got changed to Night War Justice. I guess they're trying to make it a more appealing, appealing. title. There you go. Because mm-hmm. it was just called MMA. MMA, mm-hmm. like the name. Not MMA, like mixed martial arts. And Emma May. Yeah. That's her name. Yeah. But they changed it to Black Sister Revenge, and I bought it so much work. But that's what we're going to watch. And I will like, write it down. Yes. In the book. Calendar. Did and you write out those other ones? I did not yet. Okay. Emma May. So we got two more movies to pick from these cards. So I guess we'll do that. You'll come back on Friday and hear all about MMA. Because like I said, oh, I'll just like slight hint here. You know how PJ likes to go off about like baby mama drama and type shit like that? Well, here's the flip mode of it, I guess you'll say. Buster Rhyme shit. Well, I, won't, I don't want to spoil it, so I'm trying to... Oh. We'll, we'll find out. It's called Black Sisters Revenge for a reason. We'll find out. Oh. The spirit's probably going to fuck with it if she watches it. We'll see. Okay. So come back on Friday, hear all about MMA. And then come back next Wednesday because we got cards. And yeah. We're going to go through. We got two more picks to go so we can be done with the month of. Uh, this will be June. June. Yeah. We in the June. summertime. Yeah. Shit. yeah. It's hot out here. We yeah, out here. You know, we got sweaters and shit. Come on. on. Yeah. Come back. Yeah. Peace. Come back. Come back. You know what we discussed. Just, just come back real quick. Okay. Next week. Okay. Yeah. Boom.